The mystery surrounding Pulp and potential reunion tours has been non-stop since their split in 2002. After their breakup, the band remained apart for nine long years, before reuniting between 2011 to 2012. During this time they performed at Glastonbury in 2011, to the delight of surprised fans, and at Reading and Leeds Festival in the same year. Their final gigs before breakup number two was in December 2012, firstly in their hometown Sheffield, and finally their two shows aboard the SS Coachella Cruise. Who are Pulp? Pulp are an English rock band started by lead man Jarvis Cocker in Sheffield in 1978. In total the band have eight albums, spanning from 1983 to 2001, when their reunion album We Love Life made it to number six in the UK music charts. In 1988 they released their number one album, This Is Hardcore, but split up only three years later. Its members have changed over the years, but the 2011 most recent reunion lineup was frontman Jarvis Cocker, guitarist Russell Sr., keyboard slash backing singer Condidot Oil, drummer Nick Banks, bassist Steve Mackey and guitarist Mark Weber. Frontman Jarvis Cocker released his debut album with follow-up band Jarvin Summer 2020, after delays due to the coronavirus pandemic lockdown restrictions. It got rave reviews, mostly attributed to Jarvis himself, but the band never reached number one. Why did Pulp split up? The exact reason for the band splitting up is not entirely clear but several members have publicly expressed unhappiness with fellow musicians. Speaking to the Yorkshire Post, guitarist Russell Sr. said, I put Pulp down big time, after Jarvis's famous incident at the Brits in 1997. He invaded the stage whilst Michael Jackson was performing, wiggled his bottom at the crowd as a show of distaste, then left the stage. The band was surrounded by press scrutiny and criticism from fans for its erratic behavior, so they eventually called it a day. Despite this, Russell returned to the band for the 2011 reunion. Speaking to Enemy in 2015 Cocker compared Pulp to a dormant volcano. He said, you can think wow, that's dormant and then the next day your house has gone, because it's erupted. They released their final single as a band in 2012, called After You, which reached number 101 in the UK singles chart, but managed number 10 in the UK indie chart. When is the Pulp reunion happening? Exact dates for a reunion is yet to be confirmed, but they will be releasing new music in 2023, and there will be gigs announced in due course. Drummer Nick tweeted, Hey folks, unsurprisingly it's has all gone a bit mental on here. Gig details will be revealed as and when. Stay calm, hug your hashtag Paul Records and dream of going mental sometime in 2023. Fans have gone wild for the news, with one commenting on Twitter I can't plan my wedding until I know what dates you guys are playing.